Also, D, D changed his build, by the way. Uh, Omeo magic with uh, Switchblade. What was I doing in here? Well, he's e well, he's technically just only doing the build more for the casting, if anything, than the glaive, from what it seems. Yeah, There's just a. Match, yeah. Uh, just a forewarning to when it comes to sheath moves, D. If you're locked onto something, it will. St you'll. You probably won't use it, so you might want to be very careful when you're using any form of. Which which axe which, which axe skill is it? No problem. Which okay. axe skill is it? Hmm. Yeah, you gotta be very careful of that. As I said, D, pretty much those sort of moves don't really come out really easily, especially if you're locked on. So, be very careful when you're using. You hold down R1 and you, well, you sort of try to do both at the same time, seemingly. But, like, it's, no, like, it's, like, it's doable. It's just you can't do it locked on. It's just very stubborn of a button setup. Stop that, asshole. Oh yeah, it'll probably definitely reduce your strength for sure in the co-op. <laughs> Really, I usually get one T drop pretty easily. I mean, without the uh, level sync, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's weird. I would feel like it would not apply to us, though, because we don't have that, though. So. Oh, hello! I didn't realize that was a fucking douchebag soldier. Oh, No, or I'm pretty sure you're probably dying less than me right now. <laughs> well, why is the no sync thing happening? Well, because he has it set so that way he can farm shit. That's why. Oh, Jesus, place you're at. You're playing with fire there. Guy. 
because we're in a stink cloud. Oh, hello. Minecraft. I mean, you haven't died in one hit yet, Blaze, so I mean... Yeah, you should keep it on, because you might actually do yourself a favor when it comes to stuff. Hey, test your skill. Here we go, pretty much like we would have had to reset the level because Blaze thought he was still in level sync. God, it's one of these weapons. Fucking infinite stamina. Or key. Well, don't forget, we're, we're sort of in multiplayer. Don't forget, they have a lot more regeneration key. more a uh, fist of the, like, the furious fist or something. I don't really remember. There was something I remember at one point had, a, like, a title that was very aggressive. Christ. <laughs> Stupid monkey. Let me see. Kick. Careful, there's a trap okay. on the floor. The guy keeps stepping on it. Yeah, I'm well okay, aware. Okay. I'm just mic testing with you guys. He kills himself. That's a no share thing. Hey, it's working. That's what it was. Come here. Yeah, it was. Why I have multiple different settings in the settings menu if you just have that one setting? He has four on that. Set up when you get it. What the fuck? Hello? 
<laughs> sorry about that. Now where were we? What? He said sorry about that. Now where were we? Oh. When he died. Oh, you're talking about that. Yeah, they step on the floorboard over and over. Careful, you're gonna do it again. Did somebody have like the elephant to cast or something? Yep. yep, I have because that's what I need for confusion. Like this is a specific build. This is like a fast spin to win. Like I'm not using any buffs. I need to start using more buffs. <laughs> that's what I was nice hoping shot. for to happen. What's so the that boss? Was an appropriate time for a nice shot, right, Tiger? Uh, wait. Uh, sure. <laughs> I think it's two, or it's just like yokai spam or something. I don't know why you wasted your debuff on him. He's not even a boss. He's just a basic bitch. Yeah, I still have that. I still have that. It's fine. He's confused so much. What the fuck? This thing spawns on top of me. This bill can output the same amount of damage as my other. Well, yeah, I mean, it's a barrage of shit. They're freaking monks, man. Jason's. I'm like, what the fuck? Oh, they're both. They've already. Wait, did they get down that NPC? No, they're just up above on me. Hey, you. You got. What? No, no. God damn it, they're both on me. God. I forgot how. I'm dead. Oh, their confusion. I should have this. I should have kept my skill for this. Yeah, I really don't like when there's two of them. Or oh, three of them, actually. There were three? Yeah. I didn't even notice the yeah, third one. Yeah, I, 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 I fought the fourth, third one and killed him. Oh, there's a teak up here if you want, guys. Oh, there was a teak up somewhere it's here. Probably just for you. I, I don't know, I didn't really pay much attention to what we picked up. Oh no, there is one for me, yeah, another one. I didn't pick that one. Oh, Shimaru is called. Another one. Also, if you're gonna play with level thing, make sure you pick up every soul core. Sometimes I don't really pick all the soul cores. Wait, what? Why? Because some of the soul, any soul core could be level 150. Forgot I need to do it that way. I need to change my stance, do demon dance and low stance to get the fire buff on enemies. Yeah. Then I need to do it in mid stance to get the water buff. Do we have Demon Dance Man? Yeah, Lightning, Fire, Lightning and Fire, Demon Dance Heaven, and Courage. Hello? What the fuck? Oh, just teleporting Revenant is all. Spin to win! <laughs> I'm just gonna quickly open this door. Okay. Hmm. 
Oh, I need to quickly go to the shrine. Give me a moment. That doesn't matter. Blaze, this, there's not really much to this area anymore. Oh, this is the last one. Oh, yeah, the crystal. I forgot about it. Yeah, it's just simply it's just crystal. It's not even a boss. Yeah. Oh, this guy drops the what? What? Yeah, this guy drops the katana. I think this guy drops the katana special art. I've got like so much special arts today. All I right. didn't have. I just haven't gotten the town fast one. Town fast one. You have to farm the Hattori guy. He drops the town fast special art. Special art, art? You mean like those techniques? Like what the I boss get the... Yeah. Yeah. Yep. The axe one is pretty good actually. Where do you get the axe one at? I'm curious about that one. Uh, you farm the, what you call him? The dojo guy. The dojo axe guy. Oh, of course. He can only drop from the dojo guy, axe guy, not the, what you call, dual hatchet guy. Yeah, gotcha. Axe only. Uh, there's a small chance, but the axe one is a parry. It allows you to parry and instantly go into a grapple. Hmm. Actually it's sounds... a really small chance, but... Sounds pretty good, actually. Yep. What out of your shit? Hello. If you go, what? If you want to go with like a good Omnius setup or build, what's the best? What's that armor set? Gen me. Yeah, gen me. No fucking clue what that is. <laughs> yeah, gen me. Yeah, armor set, and its set bonus is one of the best <laughs> one. Yeah. Omnio magic. What you call? Thing stacks like what you call it works differently like so like with omni magic if you're using something like say buff spells and stuff like that the more omni power you have the the buff will last more further but mm. the damage is not affected by omni power too much like ninja is so, a couple levels to go. so omni magic is always gonna be what you call it it's gonna be a buffer only omni magic is always gonna be buff Compared to Nejitsu, who's gonna be a buff damage type? Yeah, pretty much. That's what I've noticed too. I think after this, I'm gonna go with. I think I'm gonna go with a full pure Omnia build after this. Hmm. Like a pure Omnia switch glaive build. Yeah, I mean, sorry, what D is doing right now. Uh, I have no clue what the hell you're gonna go with though. Since he's trying to get uh, attack buffing, casting. damaging, buffing, damaging, using a switch glaive as my weapon mostly. Or a spear. I'm liking the spear. The spear is fucking amazing. Yeah, spear is pretty awesome. Also, Tiger, is that your shooting doji's club or is it the other club? Oh no, it's the demon axe club, pretty much. Or not club, uh, the yeah, yeah, it's just a demon axe. Pretty much, like, it has surprisingly more damage than the shooting doji so far. I mean, of course, it, it I does, but yeah. Is it corrupted? Is that a corrupted club? I mean, this is corrupted, yes. No, is it traditionally a corrupted one, or did you just got lucky with uh, with its drop? Demon axe is literally just a straight up corrupted weapon. Uh, so it could be like a what you call shoot and doji replacement. I mean, I haven't really started building anything right now. This just I dro this dropped and it was just good, so I just went with it. Maybe yep. eventually I'll work on Sutin Doji. Yeah, I will recommend putting what you call. What's what's that skill called? Stamina, attack bonus, stamina, something like that. I think the reason why Sutin Doji is better in a way, if you're going for a spin to win, because it has gained Amrita strong attack. Oh, I thought it was probably the range that it also had on it. Range also, but uh, that that passive is kind of good. Gain a Rita strong attack. Yeah, pretty much. That's also corrupted. The god, the Tonfas I got is martial artist Tonfas. The reason I choose this because this thing has the highest attack skills, attack skill key consumption. As it like, what you call? Main passive that's you can't change. Mm -hmm. 
after that you just get one with purity then you put attack bonus courage on it then you put life drain melee attack then you go with attack active skill key damage and active skill break then you go with grapple damage because there's no other skill left after that really yeah okay as i said the armor you want to go for is i have one eye dragon which we have gotten uh go with candlelight you see just i got asked me d did you change your pants <laughs> i mean literally it just like literally just turned red from red to uh teal or blue or whatever yep i just changed it that's you, the only offset you know what what was my passive what was my last trophy i, I had to get what uh bene uh, summon and blemen at gate guardians or whatever you call them ls oh you mean the the acolytes Yep, because I've never summoned too many of those. I never really do them, summon them, because mm. most of the time we are in co-op, and I don't, we can't summon them in co-op. But when I'm solo, I don't summon them because I like to do it solo. Well, it's not just that, but the acolytes are just fucking stupid. Yeah, like if you get a full tank, uh, unbreakable guard character build, they are fucking good. But if you get a stupid one, eh, it's not fun. Yeah, pretty much. There you go. I summon it for you. The only time I ever use them is just to cheese revenant farming just to speed it up. Because I don't, you see how these fuckers are being absolutely bullshit when they come to their attacking you out of your attack thing. Is the boss fight gonna be right in that door? Uh, nope. Still, there's a lot of area to go through. Give me a moment, I wanna quickly check something. Go into that fire. <laughs> Wait, did you just take that poison for me? Thank Ooh. you. Yeah, no problem. I usually take bullets for my friends. <laughs> uh, God of wind damage. That's I don't know what that skill is really. Mm, that's fire. Surprisingly, you actually oh, didn't Pingu go into it. Oh, is a good one. Uh, I think I have a lot of enemy. What you call? If I block, I think I have a lot of. What you call? Like if it's a direct element, if I block, I have a uh, hundred percent resistance to uh, elemental damage. Oh, you have block. that passive? Yeah, I have, I have that on three of my equipment. Interesting. Yeah, because so if I if I guard, I have that on my helmet, my chest piece, and my gauntlets. So if I what you call if I just hold this all the en enemy that does range elemental damage they will do zero damage to me. Yeah, it doesn't work on fire like that. It only works with projectiles. Yeah, I would think so. I mean, this is environmental shit technically. Yep. Oh, he's <laughs> Oh, that was a lot of damage he did. Ah, well, don't forget, I'm also... I don't have any good armor and pretty much I even don't have stuff into health, really, so... I I need to get back into, uh, what you call, a mode of gameplay that's just not hitting one attack to kill all enemies with an axe. Mm -hmm. Because that's what literally axe builds are. Because they just do so much damage compared to other builds. I need to get back into the groove of changing my stance, doing demon dances. getting a lot more proc because this is supposed to be a confusion build hmm also this is one of the builds i'm not using tengen the what you call it the peacock well, well yeah i mean pretty much peacock is good in its you way wanna, awesome ways. you want to see what i'm using tiger what are you using after this i'll show you Fucker just keeps lagging all over the place and it's not really good. At least he got He's still alive! Oh, he survived? Are you serious? What the fuck? He's Piece of shit is uh, just too resilient. Here, yeah, let me show you my thing. What I'm using. Miss my guardian. Fleeting guardian. There it is. Look at this. I wanna wait for D. Okay. Look at this. 
Oh, you're using the uh, mermaid. Yeah. She has one of the best ones, actually. Uh, because she also has consecutive attack damage as one of her passive. Hmm. Well, I could su substitute this for the Peacock, but I'm using Peacock as my secondary. Because that thing gives me, uh, as a secondary, it gives me confusion damage, increase versus enemy. Interesting. As I said, this is like literally a confusion build for bosses. Careful, I can kill them. The right or left. Yep. Well, essentially, this build take advantage of confusion. Then after I have a lot of confusion, uh, I use what you call my otake maru because that thing is an confusion and then i just use my skills over and over again gosh i really can't I don't like that i can't use my freaking what is it called the, my freaking burst counter attack pretty much why should you use this 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 breaks their guard so good what does these fire orbs fire orbs. the ninjutsu fire orbs yeah also, Tiger, I made a build that you will be surprised when I tell you what it is. What? It's a full yokai shift, uh, ninja mage, uh, ninjutsu yokai shift build. Hmm. Essentially, I stay in yokai shift for the whole duration of the mission, and I because how I made this build, I can stay in yokai yokai build, in yokai shift for over five minutes. How do you do that? Uh, you have to get a specific armor set, equip that, then you have to get like, you also have to get a critical status, and crit, and then once your, your health is in critical, you go yokai hit, so you get more duration, then you keep killing enemies, and you get a lot of Amrita, and Amrita will keep your thing up. Because this is supposed to be a hybrid, so I'm using both her ninjutsu build, and an omni build with it, so it's my ninja build, but super enhanced, essentially, in a way. But the problem is, like ninja build, it's not good in co-op. It's a like pure solo player build. We want to have fun. Yeah, that that's pretty much as like my build is. It's more fun on solo than on to get together. Sadly, I need to like invest in some group or like not some group, just like some uh, specific stat. Group builds. Yeah, strength and stamina. Yeah, I know. It's just. I was sort of thinking going down the ninjutsu route, if anything. Yeah, ninjutsu is fun. Yeah. Like, if you don't want a hardcore farm, there is a really good armor set. You, you just get flying car too. And that thing is just... The best way, if you have what you got. Like, with, with, with my ninjutsu build, I have over 900 ninjutsu power. Yeah, do you worry about the remnant? Don't worry about the skeleton. Because this fucker has just infinite key. <laughs> As you can see from what Blaze is using, this is supposed to be his good key break move. Yeah, well, I forgot what I was saying. Uh, you were talking about something with ninjutsu or whatever? Flying Kato or yeah, like if you have the if you have Yasekani, what you want is a five set bonus uh, for Kato, not a six six one because like it like the good that it says it's good. It feels like the build is like the five Kato bonus is good, but it's actually really a bad one. You're gonna lose a lot of damage if you go with a six East Kato armor set, flying Kato. Yeah, because like five set Kato. Let me see real fast. Is uh, yeah, ninjutsu bonus, uh, damage bonus, ninjutsu power A. Uh, it sounds good, but it's Fuck not you. actually. What you wanna go is go with like a what you call a eager jonin set. Like get a eager jonin armor set, whichever you, whichever one you prefer. So you can get yeah, it like yeah, you can get it on your chest, gauntlets, waist guard, or greaves. Yeah, okay. I'll recommend getting it on your boots because. Because one of the eager sets bonus is what you got ninjutsu power 45, which is way better. And also you wanna use Hanzo the Demon Spear as your stat stick. 
it's a spear you get from defeating Hanzo, obviously, in the dojo missions. Yeah. You want to use that as your stat stick. Because that's just going to be a stat stick, you don't have to roll anything on it. Okay. Yeah. Then you get two piece or three piece if with a Sakani, and that will give you more damage. Hmm. Uh, also, you want to use a katana as your main weapon because katana can get damage bonus equipment like that, and your uh, your equipment is gonna be super low. You're always gonna have a agility, so it's way better to use that for a ninjutsu build. Yeah, because you're you're not gonna have too much armor because your all the ninjutsu armor set is really what do you call defend less defensive and less weighty. Okay. You can always refine it and standard double refine it to get what you got. To get a little bit more damage. He's confused, then I do this. And he had, then he dies. <laughs> he took quite a while to die there. Yeah. Uh, as I said, this is not fully like confusion. When he doesn't get too much confused with more enemies. The more elements there are, the more vulnerable he gets. Oh, hello. That priority buff is so stupid. Increase attack whenever I perform, whenever I get a little, even a little bit of priority symbol on him, it just increases my attack a lot. If I get a full priority proc, it just increases it stupidly. Oh, asshole. You like doing that? Also, the helmet is your preference. If you want to use the helmet in Ninjutsu build, it's your preference. I use Mataza because it gives me faster movement speed whenever I kill an enemy, and faster movement on Ninjutsu is nice. Gotcha. Because you're gonna always gonna kill enemies with your Ninjutsu. One thing you need on all of your equipment is Shuriken damage, Untouch Ninjutsu, and Ninjutsu power on all all of your armor set. Okay. Getting that is gonna be hard because untouched ninjutsu you can only you can't get it on any everything every piece of gear. Uh, same with uh, what you call shuriken and kunai damage. Hmm. You have to orange inheritable shuriken and kunai damage, uh, and white inherit uh, untouched ninjutsu on all of your gear. Wow, that sounds like an absolute bitch. Well, not because they made it so farming with friends are way, it's way more easier than before. Essentially. Uh, I can just die for you with those gear and you can just get it from me over and over again. True. They made it super easier. I just noticed something. Yeah. You're using a corrupted weapon, I'm using a purified weapon. <laughs> That's saying something. Uh, yeah, the reason I'm saying that because if you if you corrupt an enemy and I can attack him, he's gonna lose that corrupted box super fast. If I corrupt an enemy, I, if I purify an enemy and you use your weapon on him, he's gonna lose the purity box faster. Yeah, that sort of sucks. Yeah. Also. You yeah. want agility, as I said, like for every build, this is like an all build I will say, get whatever thing you're gonna use as your main weapon, uh -huh. main rage weapon, just get damage bonus agility on it. That is gonna give you damage on every piece, anything you do, as long as you have that equipped. It's just gonna increase your damage for every build. Gotcha. After that, make sure you pay attention to your clans and make sure you also max out your clans. Okay. Good job, idiot. Wait, there's two of them? Wait, that guy didn't it. Oh, this guy oh, this just... Is, this is the normal... Yeah, the normal Minecraft. That guy was the other one. I was gonna say, like, he was over here for a second, and then he just was over here. Like, what the fuck? 
Uh, uh. Oh, give me a moment. Also, barrier jam is something you might want to put also tiger on yourself. Yeah, I have one on right now. It's just I didn't think it was really relevant to the core. Although, she's proving me wrong. Yeah, I'll do the same. <laughs> she is taking so much of a beating, Jesus! Well, she was the boss. Oh, she dropped getting me Omni Magic Shoes for me. Weird. Yeah, the barrier charm is fucking amazing. Oh, yeah. The only problem with Axe Bill is dispels, what you call. I think. Oh, is that barrier charm? I think that's the other charm. What is barrier? Oh, it's key recovery, yeah. So it's not as good for Axe Bill because it's gonna get rid of all the Yoka Yeah, that's fine. I don't really do that build. Like, it's partially what I use it for, but like I don't really like heavily crutch on it. Not heavily crutch on it, but that damage bonus is always nice, because it's just gonna increase your damage, double double or triple your damage. Yeah, keep doing that, waste your key, keep wasting your key more. Wait, let this little shit, let, let this little shit, oh, I was gonna say. Yeah, yeah just, you should have just let oh, that it. little shit run his key out and then fucking punish him for it. Uh, I love shit. that move. I love that move on X where you can instantly go into a grapple when the enemy's key is like down. <laughs> well, no, like it, I didn't. It wasn't like I don't have that move. It's just literally like I just hit him and then oh, I you just grapple him. The grapple. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking about the move where you swing your axe in a, like a round circle and then you grapple onto the enemy. There is a move for that. I didn't realize. That. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's an axe move. I was gonna say, was he gonna blow up on you? <laughs> one, one thing good about this build, this build has a lot of health. Yeah, hold up, hold up, pull him back. Alright, well I guess you can handle him and I'll just pull this guy out of this. I'm loving this build. Oh yeah, it's a lot of fucking little shit. I forgot about something really fun about Omni Magic build. What? Essentially, if you use the armor set, the Genme armor set, essentially is one of the armor set or weapon as a buff. Which essentially, if you use the buff. Uh, like if you use the buff, essentially it's. Oh, I forgot I also had that. Yeah, essentially if you use the buff, it will put. If you depends on what armor set you're using, it's gonna do two things. If you proc one status on him, he's gonna go into his his attack is gonna get lowered, so a D we great jam. Or if you put uh, another status on him, the other status he's gonna get the uh, defense down jam. Essentially, it's free. It's one jam, but two. What you call it. essentially two two different things, mm -hmm. and that's on one of the Omni Magic armor sets. Also, I forgot one thing I loved about this build also, just because it has a lot what? of what you call uh, life recovery on a rebound option. It's just like you can keep going. Yeah, I mean, pretty much. Like, the name of the game is to be aggressive with Tontos, which is why I like them. Yep. Aggressive, aggressive, and aggressive. There's a shrine over there, D, if you need it. Thank you. 
Yep, one of the things I missed about the axe build is just being able to break, like, guards, pretty much. Oh, I forgot what I have that one. I need to use that skill more. Uh, can I hit this, possibly? Mountain Breaker. Nope. Uh, hold up, hold up. Wait, 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 Blaze. Oh. Wait! Yeah. No. Oh. <laughs> well, never mind. Uh, he did not give a fuck for that explosive. That was going. That was my whole combo. If I go with like full, whole combo build, I do a shit ton of like what you call damage to them. If I go full combo, come on, asshole! I know you want to flail. All right, are you just gonna? Yeah, he's a dick. Nothing new. Come on, asshole. Surprised that actually landed. Ow. You know, one thing I'm loving, I, I forgot about how much I loved about the axe build was the mm -hmm. armor set. Like, that armor set, it decreases damage so much. Like, Kintaro's armor set just decreases your damage by a lot. Yeah. Like, I could stay in a dojo mission. Like, when I was farming, no, I'm not dojo mission. What's his name? William, when I was fighting William with level sync on, he was doing like less than 100 damage to my health and it would take him like 13 straight strikes to kill me. So literally if pretty I... much that Kentaro's armor is really that good, huh? Yeah, it's really good. Because it also has damage taken. Minus also. Hmm. Hold up, you might want to... But the problem is it's just heavy. And to get the whole bonus for the armor set, you want to get like what you call that build. What you call that thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't start here. Where's the shrine? Where's the shrine? No, okay. Now, just fine. I guess I'll have to go rest at the shrine too. Yeah, because I saw... I, I, my things were not fully charged. What the fuck? How did you keep your barrier and all your stats on? Hold on. No, yeah. I don't have that's campus. Uh, why should <laughs> that's that's my different thing. I don't know why I use that. Life leech also need to use life leech. Right. Gonna move life leech forward. I actually managed to have the right shit on to do that. Oh god, oh, yeah, that guy's fucking lagging. lagging. Shit. I'm glad I'm not the only one that saw that. Yeah, he was doing it in like one frame. I was like, what the fuck? I don't even know why I'm bothering to try to break this part. I'm just doing this over there. I'm just doing damage. This guy has how. some serious fucking issues. Also, one thing about my Otake Maru, I just they told you guys. What? This Otake Maru has uh, health, uh, lifesteal on yokai ability hit. Yeah, it's pretty good to have on what uh, on multi with, hits. With yokai ability damage, fifteen percent. Yeah, that's what I consider to be the perfect set. Wait. You are the samurai from before. Now, if only you can get yokai efficiency to go on there, then that will be perfect. There's, there's no yokai efficiency skill that you can get. You can get it on an armor set. No, 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 you the... can. You can get it off of a yokai soul core. Oh. It's very rare, though, of course. <laughs> I only have it on the yeah, freaking Yeah, I also hag. have attunement cost on it. I also have minus attunement cost. That's how I'm able to get uh, Ryumin. Otake Maru and a Maelstrom Skull because you need two of those with a two man cost to equip these. Yeah. Yeah, that's one of the skills with uh, with the what you call the, the Omni build. The Omni build has yokai ability uh, uses less efficiency. Yeah, it's like a thirty or for forty percent efficiency. Mm -hmm. 
I mean, I guess it makes sense. After all, pretty much those uh, Omnio monks pretty much did have, like, the ability to cast or spawn those Oni bees. Yep. I think next build is either Omni or Odachi. I've seen people say Odachi is one of the good weapons. Oh yeah, Odachi is pretty amazing. I would recommend doing that as their next build. Especially I have if you to want... see around what's what I want to use. Like here's the thing, for most of these skills, I'm not watching any guides and stuff. I just see what good it is. I I read it on the internet for what people consider good. Then I test those out. If those feels right to me, I make a build around those. Or try to make a build around those. I check the armor sets also because I have all the armor set uh, smithing text. You have game. all the fucking armor smithing text? Are you kidding me? Yeah, all the armor sets, not the weapons and uh, what you call and the other accessories, special accessories. I swear to God, Blaze, you have a little too much free times on on your hands. <laughs> But well, I'm just getting that randomly just by, by farming because Otake Maru drops a lot of shit, William drops a lot of fucking shit, uh, Ryuman, the spin to win guy we use, that drops a lot of these. Uh, like every boss has like 10 or 15. I do a lot of dojo missions, those also drops me a lot of smithing. Those are my punching bags essentially. I test my builds against those guys. Bonfire, you know why he sleeps through the sessions. <laughs> Oh, this is a Squish Boy. Love seeing these revenants. Yeah, that was a um, like that guy was a full Omnio build because he dropped me three get me Omnio set. Wow. Shit. Get your poise out of here, you slut. I need to use that skill more. Also, PS4 prize, PS5 prize. Kind of got leaked, but it's not official yet. Prize? Uh, yeah, PS5 prize. PS5 prize, actually. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, price? That didn't sound right. Uh, it's gonna start from either... Start from 450 to 500 to 5, 550. Hmm. Also, it's gonna be limited for the in the first year. Hmm. Well, that's no surprise. I mean, I doubt there's gonna be anything good on it for a while, so... Yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna get a day one. Just because it's gonna be limited and people are gonna get a lot of it in India. Well, I mean, considering since it seems like the product's coming out, like... Like, yeah, pretty much the older the product, it seems like the better it is, because we've seen how my controllers are. You will like dual sets, Tiger, like, PPS Force 5, 5 controller called dual sets, you will like that, because it's supposed to be way more tougher, they're using a better material, uh, more powerful buttons, uh, uh, I will say you will like the controller, it looks also fucking amazing. Better be amazing, because I'm seriously sick of only shitty controllers. Well, also, it's backward like compatible. Right now. Uh, it's also backward compatible with PS4. Hmm. Dual sense. Also, has more buttons on it. It's a back button attachment. Hold up! Didn't they say the same thing about PS4 at one point, and then they just decided not to do it? No, I'm talking about the, just the controller. You can use PS3 controller on PS4. There's nothing stopping you. Yeah, after using these humongous controllers versus the small controllers, I don't think I'm going to be comfortable with it. Uh, DualSense is smaller. You will like that also. It's smaller than PS4 DualShock controller. Well, that's going to be hard to get back into. It's not as big, like, it's like, when you say small, I'm talking about, it's like, wide. Wideness is different, like, like, the difference when you see, like, below it, like, between the two handles where you hold a controller, that's, like, less. Yeah, D, you're just gonna just sit there. <laughs> like, what the fuck, man? 
I just got broke heart and key broken. That's one of the really good abilities to break their key. I mean, in general, it's pretty good just because it can proc water and heat fire. The only problem is it does shit damage. Really? It honestly feels like it does good damage compared to most abilities. Yeah, well, like it hits good. a lot, it procs a lot of element, but it doesn't do good, as much good damage as like something like... Like, it's just like I'm really spoiled on what you call Otakemaru. Well, yeah, because you're spoiled for that. It's definitely one of the better yokai abilities, though. Yeah, it is. Like this and Andra, the tornado guy. Uh, is one of the better ones. In all honesty, I did not like. It, yeah, it's okay, but honestly, I, I don't really see that ability super as super great. Maybe it was like better when it was barehanded at one point. No, 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 it was. But even without that, it's still good. Hmm. Also, yeah, uh, what you call Yami no Kami is also really good. What's 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 that called? The snake one, the snake boss. That one is also good. Yeah, that one's good. Problem is, is if you're like, it's like good if you're in a narrow corner door, you want to get the most damage out of it. But if you're like, say, in like a wide open space, it can do less damage. Oh, yep, that was the spin to win, I'm assuming, right? Yep. Ow. Damn it. I wanted to get that brute out to knock her down and do some serious damage to her. Oh, that's spin to win! Fuck that shit, Lord! Also, did any of you guys try the new weapon? Uh, the new weapon we got in Warframe? Uh, no. It was that. Uh, that's it was a, two weapons that we got. It's Bas. Yeah, it's a Lasada and Basmo. Basmo is a gun. Uh, Basmo is a debuff laser gun. It has like a specific unique debuff. Ow. That's not tied to any status or anything, it's like a special debuff. Yeah, Blaze, I would recommend if you have Brutes with you, you might want to do that at the end of your combos if you're out of key. Uh -huh. It's good for uh, key breaking. That's a problem. I have Feral and Phantom. Because I need the bonuses from Feral, from Tengen. Gotcha. Then I need to use this thing because... I wish you could change their nature. But you can't change Soul Guardian's nature. You can change the nature of... I agree. Oh, great. We got a fucking gunner boy up there. Fuck you, asshole. But yeah, I was gonna say, if you add Brood on to your combo list, pretty much you could be a serious non stop freaking train. Because you actually get key back at when you do a Kyokai shift. Yep. Usually how I steamroll a lot of human humanoid bosses. The shame that's the, although at the start of a Revenant summon you have let you're limited to not being able to cast your abilities until like a couple seconds in. So that's sort of why I don't do Brute at the start, as you probably saw. Yep. <laughs> I love that. It doesn't do that. Oh, this guy got... I, I feel like this guy didn't take any damage from a grapple. That's just stupid. Oh yeah, he's taking nothing Again. for damage. Like, what the fuck? Oh, there was this guy hidden back here. <laughs> oh, that's probably not good, because those skeleton shitlords can actually be a problem. When you're fighting a revenant, at least. I'm loving that healing coming. Uh. Like, D, D, does your character even wear underwear underneath those pants? Because seriously, it's just nothing but legs oh. under there, from what it looks no. like. She doesn't. Oh, she's going commando. Mostly Fair like me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's the leg white. What? The leg wipes? What? The leg wipes! Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, loincloth. You're talking about the loincloth. Yeah, see, they just, yeah, they just hold the legs. Come on, sag bag. Uh, 
Wow, actually that slowdown sort of actually screwed me slightly. No, it's fine. Just so used to pretty much just like freaking going on our default speed. This this thing is just moving, it's not stopping. Yeah, that's the annoyance of Lamias. Alright, we got a big fat blob of disgustingness up ahead, and I think some archers above us. I was gonna do this on him. <laughs> well, that was but a waste. But he died way earlier. Just because I took down his defense low, he just took a stupid amount of damage. Uh, yep, I that ability is broken. It's one of the brokenest mage spells you can get. The defense down. Uh -huh. Because if you get it on yourself, your enemies will go from doing like 200 damage to 800 damage per strike. And that's from the water one. And here's the thing, they fixed the glitch. Uh, uh, Tiger, when, you remember when I told you they made it so, what you call? Uh, you can't put both water and that arm on? Yeah. That's actually a gl glitch. Oh, gotcha. Cat, I don't need your shit right now. I was gonna say, did his key not go down at all when I did that? Well, this bridge is just moving so much. Yeah, that's usually revenants that have a lot of key in hell. Yeah, go on, do it, do it, keep doing it. You waste your key, I dare you. Go on. That, Good that job. That was too. one in a. That was like one oh, of the I'm best key. MLG throw. MLG. What you call? Seriously. Yeah, it's a similar thing. <laughs> no, it's not. Uh, you just need to add some reason that dodged... you're you're fitting in with them. <laughs> oh god! Uh, essentially, I... <laughs> essentially, I dodged the what you call the Lavinia's what you call uh, stare at like the last second using the brutes uh, using the Feral's dash. Well, yeah, I mean, Feral's dash is technically just a dodge, just pretty much a burst counter. Sort of one of the reasons why I was thinking about using Feral, but at the same time, it's not very reliable when it comes to burst countering too. Oh my! Had damage. What, what the fuck? I did 10,000 damage with one of the grapples. Hmm. I mean, grapple damage just, it does do a lot of damage. Well, I do also have grapple damage on my. On there you also go. Because... You answered your question. But still, 10,000, that's a lot. Because the first strike I did was 2,000. Then the last strike just did 10,000 for some reason. Well, don't forget that pretty much bonuses do have quite the effect. Well, he was confused, he was purified, uh, and I do have something like that. Yeah, he will. I'm loving the demon dance. I will say that I'm loving demon dance. Wait, which one is, oh, like, are you talking about the back step, like, ev evasion? Yeah, because it increases my damage. It does? But that's how I made this build. Yeah, that's how I made my build. It's pulverized demon damage, so it's increasing my damage a lot whenever I do this move. Demon not then to do this Oh, move. cool. God damn it. A little slut really pisses me off. What do you think? It's the disgusting harpy bitch. You wanna get out of this area? Oh, thank you, harpy. Well, we want to keep her in this area so that way she can't really just get away super easily. Like so, because she only has like one place to go, and that's trying to get around you for the most part. Yep. I will say that I, as much as I love this bell, it's like it became one of my favorite bells. I still love the axe build the most. Because you're immortal, pretty much. You're immortal. You have stupid amount of damage. You. It's also fun to play with the buffs and stuff. Oh 
boy, Blaze. You play a risky game when it comes to Beyblade's fucking non burst counter bolt to Beyblade. Yeah, because he's using X, his damage is just out through. Which is really weird when you think about it. Because this, my, like, when I look at the base damage of my, what you call him? That's a can. My Yogi. axe. Like, when I use the, when I see the base damage on that thing. Mm hmm. Uh, Hello. It's like, what you call it? It's literally the base damage is same as this, but when I do like a attack with the axe, it does like like that 20 times more damage than my current thing, my town path. Fuck. Also, we have to break that crystal. Oh, that's not good. That's Canon Yoki with a Kurosama Yoki. Yeah, that doesn't do anything to that thing, I forgot. Yeah, and a Kurosami Yoki, too. So, uh, we're gonna have fun with this. I at least pulled the Kurosami douche away. Yeah, I'll take care of the cannon one. I don't know if I can take care of the freaking Kurosami one. He's a fuckboy. Thank yep. you for the on-demand healing, whoever healed me. That was not a surprise. I can't fight the Kurosami Yoki. Oh, where'd you die? Right behind yeah, you. Yeah, I was like, I, I saw where you were, where you were. I was like, he should spawn here, but he's not really oh, far away. Oh, fucking controller? Yeah, it was this small guy that was doing a lot of damage. I saw him also attacking you. Well, no, it was just literally, I got hit by the freaking Kurosami guy. He's just bullshit in general. And co-op, not so fun. What's the boss here? I, I need to remember what's the boss. Yeah, it's the guy that we're using. I think it's an easy spin. one. Y yeah, it's oh. the dual freaking fire guys. Oh, fire, I remember this area. Yeah, before, yeah, before, yeah, before we fight this guy, we have to fight uh, what you call one of those NPC uh, phantoms. What? what are you talking about? No, we don't. Yeah, we have to fight one of the uh, NPC revenants in a yokai area. So he's gonna start in his yokai form. Oh yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. No, we don't it's... have to fight. We don't have to fight it. We just can go to the left and kill the uh, Yoki that's guarding the ladder to go kill the guy that summons it. Still, well, I mean, we're, we're gonna, gonna be fight fighting him. revenants anyway. So I mean, yeah. Speaking of which, where are the enemies? Oh, most of the enemies can't be seen without this. Oh. <coughs> Hello. Do it again. Do it again. Do it. Hmm. You need to pop one of these. Where is this at? Here it is. I think most of those hits actually missed, ironically enough. No, he didn't block it, he just literally missed him. Also, He's I'm just getting stuff. Also, uh, I just... Uh, I saw Nio one build video, and essentially, on the highest difficulty, people are able to one-shot bosses with ninjutsu. Oh, I'm not surprised. Ninjutsu seems to be the way to go if you want to one-shot people. It kind of is, but at the same time, there's more powerful builds also, or as powerful as that. Not powerful stuff. Uh, it, it can be blocked easily by this ninjutsu, there's one thing you could do. If you like fast enough and you have the ninjutsu casting speed or something like that, which increases ninjutsu casting speed, you can put enemies and ravenets into a permanent stun lock if you're fast enough with your ninjutsu. 
Fuck, I really love that I missed that. That guy definitely had nothing for key recovery. Hello? Man, I sort of wish that those uh, shiny revenants that I had last session, or not last session. What session was uh, I would say put one of your, what you call, things here, Tiger, uh, one of your benevolent graves somewhere like near the, mm -hmm. like this area, so you can get more people. Well, this is one of the farming areas. So oh, I just come here and I just see a lot of divine gear drops. Yeah. I'm collecting these because these are good Amarita. Yeah, I just want a regular gloves. If if we get those, I will be just happy with this. We have gotten two sets from this mission, so I'm happy. Because irregular gloves, most of the irregular gloves you're gonna get in co-op are gonna have orange attack on them. And as double. Yeah, I've gotten a lot of those when we played, in all honesty. Yeah, but m none, most, like, they're also really common that have, like, specific things on them. Like, specific, like, damage skills and stuff like that. That's why, that's what I found to get all the right damage on this thing. <laughs> on, on higher. She was, like, literally pinned in the corner, so yeah. I killed all the enemies here so you guys can just concentrate on not on these things. Oh, I remember this place. Oh yeah, I remember getting fucked in the ass constantly. In this place. A lot of shooters here. I would really like if there was one more slot and they, it had torn for gun on it also, this build. Just for that added range. Problem is, I believe the gun, the Tonfa gun thing, pretty much that, like that Tonfa is like a pretty weak Tonfa when it comes to damage, like its default stats. Yep. Oh, this is one of the areas where I was missing one Kodama. I did this mission today to get my last Kodama from here. Where was your last Kodama at? Uh, I think it was. Downstairs, yeah, it was downstairs uh, underneath the crystals hidden way there. Makes sense. Yeah. This is also where we fought uh, uh, mages, Omnio mages for Abaddon, their quest. Yeah, farming the Omnio mages to be able to unlock that mission, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that's the cave we take. Do you wanna do the cave route so we can kill the crystal fast yeah, or do you wanna do it? Let's go down to the cave, less grief, I believe. Cause I believe there's cannon yokis up there now. Yeah, there are like five cannon yokis. Oh god. He likes the flex. I'm gonna fight that guy. She just has a lot of defense if she has that crystal on her. And she's actually just dead, okay. Oh hey! Big boy. down below. Do you remember when I told you uh, when, I, when I got my Yasekani tiger from doing the main boss? Uh, what about it? I got really lucky with that Yasekani. You know why? What is a Yasekani? I have no clue, do you? Because it has a plus 10. Uh, it's an accessory that reduces uh, set bonus requirement by one. So essentially, if you be essentially to get like a 5 set bonus or 6 set bonus, you just bear 5 set bonus. 
five five gears. Of that set, then you put a Yasakani and you get the six set bonus. Mm -hmm. That's how you you can get multiple set bonuses on a belt with the Yasakani. Okay. Essentially, this Yasakani I got, I got super lucky, and I got a Yasakani that was plus ten because my blacksmith was max. So there's a really small chance that all the accessory or gears I get will come with a plus ten. That's nice. Uh, it's, it's a blacksmith thing you have to upgrade or you have to pay with patronage to the blacksmith. Did we come up here? What you doing down there? Yeah, me the loot. Yeah, it's a pat yeah, it's a patronage ability. You have to max that out. You have to max out the minimum, then the maximum. You have to max Yeah, it's in it's for Muramasa, it's not for the normal blacksmith, it's for the Muramasa. Fuck yeah, to hear you cannon piece of shit. Hmm? What am I witnessing down here? This thing destroys them so fucking. Uh. Yeah, I've noticed that the. The feral Yokis are a lot less tanky than the brute Yokis, but it makes sense because they fucking dodge and shit. Yeah, but their damage is just so massive compared to them. And they're faster. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, the Korasami one is definitely the one I hate the most out of those freaking feral Yokis. Yes, Gunny. Luck bonus on these guys. I thought I had that. I need to get back. And uh, I died. Yeah, I said I, I played it. I played like really, really. There you go. I used combat. Uh, yeah, I played. Uh, I I said I only put. I am playing it really slowly. How far have you gotten so far? Uh, I'm in the chapter seven. Oh, does, it have that, that does it have that two disc swap thing that... Yeah, there's gonna be multiple discs, but people who bought the, what you call, the thing will get all the discs for free. I was gonna say, I, thought they were, I didn't know if they were gonna do that gimmick of the two disc thing that like, they did in the previous one. Yeah, that was because those discs were low. That was before Blu-ray was yeah. a thing, Tiger. So they need to have multiple discs. Fuck you, you stupid skelly bitch. So if you buy the premium edition or whatever it's called, you get all the all the CDs for free? No, even if you buy the normal edition, D. That's really insane. I can't imagine that they would do that. It's just, it's just like how when you bought the first Final Fantasy VII, you will get the both to disc 1 and disc 2. It's like right. that, D. Yeah, doesn't matter if this guy, if the game was four years in making or ten years in making. One thing is really weird about what you call Square Enix's game. I'll tell you guys, is their save files. They are massive compared to other games. Save files, save files. Mm. Like for example, let's uh, we kill the bitch. Uh, essentially, so uh, my Final Fantasy 15 save file. That save file is two gigs. That alone save file. Yeah, Final Fantasy 15, which I don't have, uh, I have less than 10 hours, is already 200 MB. This game where I have over 100 hours is 16 MB only. 16 MB. Yeah, Compared to other games, Square Enix is every Square Enix's game is. Yeah, they're quite just, girthy they're safe and size. Are <laughs> Which is like a weird thing. 
I mean, not really, with all the effects that they have in their games. I mean, honestly, I'm not surprised. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna buff before I fight this fucker because, uh, this guy's not fun. Or never mind, you, I guess you just have him, I guess. Yeah. Oh no, you just kill it? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I will recommend Tiger if you can get that skill. The skill I'm using that gives you thing. That just, as I said, I've been telling you guys to get that for a long time now because that will just boost your survivability a lot. What skill is it, Blaze? The Emerita Absorption. That's what I fucking have, man! How much do you have? I have the freaking clan thing, and I think I have one on the armor. It's just the fact is, these guys do more damage than what I can heal. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, get it to plus 10. Get your one of your armor piece to plus 10. You will see a big difference, my man. Because I have one of them, what do you call? Rank uh, 10 on, on my armor piece. Yeah. And my fucking god, plus 10. Uh, and I'm getting like, instead of like 16, I get 25 from my armor piece. Then I don't have the max heal, but I have it on my Yasakani. Because my Yasakani is a plus 10 also, which is really, really rare because you can't temper or soul match accessories. Yeah. You can temper, temper them, you can't soul match them. So I have 30, uh, 25 and 36. But even with that, it should boost your damage enough. It, it should boost your survivability a lot. Especially if you use Pallades and stuff like that. Extraction Pallades, yeah. Mm. I mean, it's just pretty much the fact that I just can't take a hit because I, again, I don't have Vitality Max out, please. So, I yeah, probably that should. Really kills you a lot. Mm -hmm. uh, you could always save this build, Tiger. That's the thing. Just save this build, switch to another build, switch to another build. Yeah, that's what I was going to do after I hit max level. Which you are really close to, actually. Time for a boss fight. Yep, uh, rest at the shrine. Do I need any? No, oh, yeah, I will also rest at the shrine. I really do not like you have that slit in your fucking pants, do you? Just bug Slit in your fucking hands? What? What slit are you talking about? L literally look at his character's pants. Does that <laughs> scream slutty or what? Uh. I'm just gonna go with not slutty. I don't feel it. it's too slutty. Mmm, she's showing legs. Yeah, she's an independent woman, there's nothing. Yeah, you know what else <laughs> does that? Twitch thoughts. Yeah, but they show like really big, big boobs. She doesn't even have boobs. It doesn't have to be boobs, Blaze. It doesn't have to be boobs. Oh, At least I can poison, but I don't think I can burn him. Oh, thank you for that poison, Tiger. Yeah, I mean, pretty much, like, that's sort of one of the aims for my build. I could actually try to see if I can keep break him. I doubt it. I can't. I can. Well, it still works somewhat on bosses. Oh, it's fucking draining. Yeah, that's good. This thing is making me fucking mad. You mean Light the fact man. that he likes to spam? And he's also... What the fuck game? Oh, what the... I'm probably he, dead. Is he lagging for you guys? Well, he certainly did a burst move that pretty much was not a grab, so yeah. You know what? I have something for you. You know what? Probably would have been a smarter invested investment to do the boss killer move, technically. Oh, I should put this. Why have I, I don't have I this one on? Back so that's on. gonna help us. What the fuck? Oh, he's still shooting at me, that little prick. That was all my fucking poison. Put some of this for first. Ow. Yeah. 
Fucking hell, that scared the hell out of me. Got this lot of wind and gate seclusion. Fucking hell. Why does it why did it have to be rainy? What, you're afraid that pretty much literally lightning's gonna oh, strike you down? Oh, and my fucking power is gone. It is. So my PS4 could be shut down any moment. That's great. That I never noticed that he becomes human after Give me a moment. Yeah, he dies. Well, good timing on that storm's part. Sarcasm. Yeah, at least we finished it. We finished the level and the, and the stage. Well, no, I'm just saying in general it's not... Oh, well, there goes Blaze. Oh, no! Oh, at least damn. we finished the level. Yeah. Well, God. Fucking damn it. Stupid thunderstorms. I know, we're having hell of a hell of luck lately. Uh... Fuckity fucky fucking shit. Great. Well, I don't know what to do, man. Not sure either. We'll give it a few minutes and see what happens. Okay, we'll level up my uh, all the other Let's see. Only two fucking levels out of that. <laughs> fucking hell. Yeah, it's uh, a little bit of a grind after you get a certain ways up, I think. I mean, like, seriously, I had 30k Amarita, and oh well, I guess it did hit pretty much 10k for requirement now. Space do I have? Yeah, it's time to sell some shit. Couple of oranges, I probably should take him. And sell the rest of this garbage. <laughs> Yay, I got enough for another level up, which I probably am not going to touch for now. Well, clearly. God, that's not good either, because that could do some serious damage. Well, yeah. I think it's more than just his PS4 just shut off, for sure. His power went out, so I mean... <laughs> well, I yeah. mean, he said his PS4 shut off. I guess we're good. Hold up. Yeah, looks like he is out of the game. Yeah, he's in a terrible side of the world, I'll tell you. Yeah, you think pretty much with the years of pretty much like technology and shit. Yeah, I don't know. Between the power outages and the internet offages and the... And the... I don't know, it's crazy. Yeah. I mean, like, yeah, I, I, it's just weird. Like, you think that pretty much after all that shit, like, the, 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 uh, their side has experience, you think they'd, like, figure out a way how to fight it off that sort of problem. Yeah, well, it's the difference between being a first world country and a third world country. 
I guess. I mean, we kind of can see the you can see the comparisons. I mean, we have you know things to prevent power shortages and internet outages, and you know they don't. Mm, well, not true. Technically, we still have power outages, and we can't do much about it other than pretty much having somebody fix it. Well, I haven't had a power outage in. Well, I mean, like it—it's not internet like we've had but, serious uh, storms or anything, but still, like it's possible. The power or internet problem is because my router was taking a shit. Hmm. Once I fix the router, it fixed it. Well, I don't know what to do about the VOD. In all honesty, it's pretty short, so I don't know if I should like keep it around. In all honesty. Well, that's up to you. Yeah, it I mean, was only an hour and a half. Yeah, that's not really significant. I might delete it if anything. beat about four levels. It's up to you. Mm, still, I'd rather it be at least like maybe two hours and a half long, so I don't know if yeah. I might keep this VOD. It's just going to be a waste of space on my laptop. My laptop yeah, already has you. plenty of the freaking streams. It's just waiting for the to get them to expire on Twitch before I poop, uh, move them over to YouTube. Hmm. I need one more piece again, May, and I'll be full set. I guess this gives me some time to actually try to level up this character to maximum so I can stop this balance build. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. One it's thing I'll do, head. I'll focus into putting, like, stuff into health and, like, probably key regen, and then I'll probably do, like, strength, possibly. Yeah, key regen's pretty good. I'd like to have more key too to go with it, but I know that probably it's like three stats that you can have max, and then one's gonna be half-assed. Mm. Well, and key's only really good if you're using uh, if you're using uh, swords. I mean, not really a having lot of blocking. not really. D pretty much it's good for being aggressive. Combine that with key. I mean, it, I mean it, it, yeah, I mean it, it is it is good for aggression too, but it's really good. Yeah, I mean, again, still, like I use my, uh, most of my key pretty much when I go all in on attacking because that's how I usually yeah, kill stuff. That's true. Yeah, yeah it's, it's true because if you don't have enough, then then if you run out of key and then they can they can gut you. Well, no, and no, it's just the fact that I try to burst out my damage to be able to get the maximum results. It's a big risk, but at the same time, it's a big reward because if it like I burst out my damage, I could pretty much break guards. I can't say the same for co-op, but like, I mean, it's probably also because I just don't have a fitting build to be able to do it. So, yeah, I'll get there, man. That yeah, Blaze has just done a lot of farming. Oh yeah, Blaze pretty much definitely can dedicate himself to a game. For me, on the other hand, I pretty much just go with what I get, pretty much. <laughs> I'm not yeah. going to sit there and for hours farming and just make the game feel like a chore. Yeah, I mean, I can do that too, I just don't care that much. I just I just kind of like playing when you guys are playing, if you're not playing, I just do something else. I mean, you should probably try playing some of the game by, your, by yourself, like, it definitely is fun solo yeah. too. I mean, I'd yeah, recommend it. Fine. Find nothing that can be controlled really, in all honesty. Yeah. Alright, well, Weather see. And internet conditions. Yep. Two Ter terrible right, things. See yep, see ya. Alright, with. Uh, Alright, I gotta pretty much like. I guess I could leave the party, I guess. Or not, never mind, D. Larry left.
But yeah, with that, guys, that will end the stream pretty much for the most part. I don't think I'm going to keep this VOD because one hour long is not really much preferable, in all honesty, for, like, length. So this VOD will probably be around on Twitch, but it will not be on YouTube, honestly. Yeah, that was way too short for what I would like for, like, a VOD posting, so... Uh, yeah, with that, we'll ch I guess we'll try again tomorrow. I guess the good thing for me is I won't have to freaking do... Well, I, nah, I shouldn't even say that. I don't even fucking do much editing on the YouTube VODs. <laughs> In all honesty, like, all I do is put a text box showing when to, where to skip to because I like... The reason why I keep, like, the parts in that pretty much should be cut out, I guess, it's because, like, D and Blaze could be talking and they could be talking about something interesting. They could also do something, well, maybe some, they might do something wacky, because I think I remember in Revenant, Blaze did some shit to me while I was AFKing. But yeah, like, that's sort of why I keep the stuff on the VODs. Or I keep that sort of stuff in the VODs. And just have it, have like a point where the people should skip to. You know? I just personally, well, it's not, it's, it, I guess in a way it's somewhat is lazy, but at the same time, not really. It's just like, I just want, for the most part, the stream the whole experience of the stream to be there because people there are people out there that like that so yeah i know i'm one of those people that likes to watch the full thing yeah sure i like if there's nothing going on i might skip over to like the part where they like the person gets back but like if there's like other people there i could like stick around and see what shit or not see but hear what shenanigans, shenanigans are going on in the background <laughs> Sometimes it could be funny. But yeah, sort of why I don't edit stuff. Or I don't, like, really cut stuff out of YouTube. The only time you'll ever see, like, some sort of cut is if, like, something, like, say, if the broadcast cut, cut off, you know? Like, uh, there are where times where literally, like, say... Like, because, like, pretty much streaming with, like, consoles are different, in a way. Because there's no, like... There's no way, like, to keep the broadcast going if you, say, close out of an application. It just stops the broadcast in general, so... That's sort of why some, like, there's some, like, streams that have, like, cutoffs like that. There's also just the fact that if, like, there's a error, like, a game error that for forces you out of the game, that sort of does that, too. Cuts the broadcast, so... Yeah. I usually just try to, like, combine those cut broadcasts together to try to mend it somewhat although it's just awkward to look at slightly so I was thinking about putting make maybe like a black screen in between to probably explain what happened but at the same time Revenant had a lot of cuts since a previous not previous uh, well yeah in like a previous session ago but yeah uh yeah anyway that was me just doing a little bit of like a chit chat there about what I like uh I don't cut stuff out of the broadcast anyway yeah I probably should end the broadcast this may not go on YouTube but then again like I, like this is extra content to be able to post since like again like I wait for the VODs to yeah, here I am still rambling yeah anyway Take care, guys. Have a good day and night. We'll try to continue this tomorrow at, like, 1 p.m. Central again. Hopefully we'll get a little bit more lucky with actually having a game session go on, and hopefully I can probably grind up the remaining levels before then so I can have a legitimate build instead of dying. Anyway, enough me r rambling. I need to cut this for sure. Take care and have a good night. See ya. <laughs> Do.